Let's try a kanafa donut. So I saw this as a comment. It does like a thousand layers of crunch to each bite. And kanafa is a popular dessert in Palestine. And I thought to myself, you know what? This might just work. And it all starts with the kanafa dough. It's pretty much like a phyllo pastry. So she'll wrap this up in this little donut mold and then cover it with clarified butter or ghee. And then bake this at 375 for about 15 minutes until it's golden brown. And to make sure it's not going to be soaked in complete fat, we're just going to drain off some of the excess clarified butter and replace that with complete sugars. So this is just a simple syrup made with sugar and water and we'll let this soak in all of that sweetness. For the cream filling, this is called kishta, which is basically a mixture of milk, cream, vanilla, clarified butter, and ricotta cheese. And with our piping bag, let's carefully pipe in some of our cream and then close it on top with another piece of the donut or the kanafa dough, whatever you want to call this. It kind of looks like a sandwich too. And then just top it off with a bit more cream, garnish with pistachios, and that's pretty much it. She's also going to be making a Biscoff one with some cookie crumbs as a garnish and she'll also make one with Nutella with some hazelnuts on top. Much love to my buddies at Kanafas for even attempting this. I'm pretty happy with the end product. All right, which one do you want to try? I'm gonna try the Biscoff one. Crunchy, yeah? Mm -hmm. I thought it was gonna be too heavy because there's just so much of the dough, but it's not. It's actually light. Out of 10, what would you give this? I'd give it a nine. Yeah, it's up there. Yeah, yeah. It's up there, it is up there. 